So welcome. You speak a little bit of English, or should I? We get yes, a little now? bit. Yes, yes. but uh, uh, so I think Satoshi went searching for you too now. So, oh, there he is. Um, Satoshi is here because he speaks very good Japanese and English, <laughs> and I only speak English. And uh, Mr. Shimizu speaks. Good morning, <laughs> um, Welcome. You, well, you just came off the stage just half an hour ago. Uh, so let's first talk about that. How how was it for you? How are you feeling now? Very tired. Tired. Yes. <laughs> you I, gave your yeah. soul. Yeah. 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 I put uh, breath to saxophone so much, and uh, yeah, now. <laughs> but I'm happy. Is it a physical experience to play the saxophone? Of course it is, but like <laughs> <laughs> how physical and うん。うん。うん。えっとね。なんだろうね。あの、サクソフォン吹くときに、え、体、体が全体が振動して、してるから、あの、終わったときは <laughs> when he's playing saxophone, it's also like so much vibration going on, so it's actually really hard to play for one hour, that's why I say. Especially, then, especially on his headphones. Oh, yeah. In, and yeah. So that's he said, like, after show, he's really like super tired. Well, we're very happy you're here now. Uh, after this, it's all breaks or enjoying other musics. Um, I have a few topics just written down, which I think uh, are, could be interesting now to talk about. Um, first of all, back to the performance. Um, it seems your, your acoustics is very important in your work and the acoustics of the space where you play in and the way uh, your sound moves into the space. Um, when you first got here today, what was your first impression or how do you how do you go to work then just from coming into the space before your performance? やってみます。で、それからいろいろ、え、あの、体の調整とか。とにかくまずはこのスペースを生かすように、あの、工夫に、工夫して、工夫してるんだけど。で、そこから調節。え、あ、every time he pray everywhere, first he try to pray without anything and he want to see like how it surrounds, the sound surrounds in the space and then he's gonna talk with PA and set up and is it then also like with extra effects or uh, something yes yes あの、石切り場って、例えば洞窟とか、そういうところで、え、うん、やることも、レコーディングとか、パフォーマンスも割とそういうところでやることを狙う。音響が整ってない。ない、そう。普通音楽をやる。そうそう。レコーディングレコー
、And、maybe you can talk in the microphone so the Japanese、okay. listeners will. えっとね、えー、この二人で始めたのは、えー、去年の去年のえっ、ー、とね夏国本玲君に会ったのかな。初めて。初めて。でそれからあのリハーサル重ねてでまあ。今年の今、えー、と7月の頭に、えー、コペンハーゲンの、えー、ロスキルドフェスティバルとそれからロンドンの、えー、ロンドンでコンサートしてこれ3回目で去年の夏,、うん、夏で、えー、そうだねあの今日やった曲は僕の、えー、82年のアルバム「かかし」の中から。とそれから新しい曲もあの含めてそれ半分半分ぐらいかなあでも最初,最初の方って新しい曲そうですねあのでもねあれはね一番最初の曲はブリジストンっていうあれタイトルであのー、えー、っとミュージックフォーコマーシャルっていう中から、えー、の曲で多分他は新しいっていうかまあそれぞれちょっとモチーフをうんうんうん。Uh, they started doing live together since last summer, last year summer, and they've done two live, two live shows. Uh, there was a first live show in, was in Copenhagen and、uh, London in July, and this time is the third show they played together. And he plays some of he, from his track Kakashi, his album Kakashi, and、yeah. some new tracks today. That is、uh, 82, uh, 1982 released. The, the, the songs that you played, yeah. We'll talk about that later, the, the old releases, yeah.、Uh, thank you.、Uh, well, let's talk about it now, because、um, I was wondering. Um, how many people know, knew of Mr. Shimizu before, like, let's say, five years ago? <laughs> That's just one. Obviously, me?、Uh, I didn't know. And, and yeah, and Satoshi, of course, because he knows every kind of music.、Um, there seems to be a revival going on in,、uh, with, with your music and I think more Japanese artists.、Um, do you feel that too? And, Is, can we speak of a revival of your music? えー、とあのまずはあの僕の「かかし」あの「猫のアルバムのかかし」っていうのと「えー、歌方の日々」これ本当に80年の初めの頃、えー、リリースしたんですけどもあのまあ、えー、廃盤にならずにずっとこう今まで、えー、あの長く。えー、セールスし,してきたんですけど、えー、やっぱりそう彼が言うように5年ぐらい前からかな、えー、多分いろんな、えー、DJ および、えー、選曲家の人たちがいろんな国で、えー、かけてくれたでそれから、えー、再リリーシュするようになってで今こういうなんか<笑>コンサートに。えーえー There was two big LPs he made, Mariah and Kakashi. And it's like he said, it's kept selling since they got released. But since five, four years ago, like, so many DJs and selectors have been played his music, and that spread his music to people. And now he's kind of happy to be like, invited everywhere. When was the first time you discovered DJs were playing your music?、Uh, I don't know. <laughs> were you at one of their sets? 
Or did someone tell it to you? Or? あ、えっとね。うん、あの、キューティーアンドボクサーっていうえ、ドキュメンタリー映画なんだけど、それの音楽もやるようになったくらい、なんかうん、うん。いろいろ、いろんな方面から。うん。He one of producer, like a film producer from director, sorry, from New York, like contacted him and then he made a soundtrack for him. A documentary film uh, of uh, QT and Boxer. Yeah. Mm. Also, he, uh, the director, uh, somehow where I'm here, my music and uh, uh, contact me. That is, I think, Kakashi or Maraya Utakata no Hibi or something. Yeah. Um, we, still about the revival and with all the reissues, it seems from a distance, like, because you, you never stopped composing or working or doing anything, but it seems like with all the reissues, you have two careers at once. You have like the old stuff and the new stuff. How is it to incorporate, com incorporate the incorporate those worlds for you yeah it, uh, it, but it, from 82 and now it's not long this time for me like a few weeks ago then that music is already uh, in, in my it yeah. doesn't feel like a past life no, or something it's no, still not now no. I'm that's kind of person or something. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's, that makes sense. Um, you mentioned earlier, like just now, to you because you also work as a composer, and people ask you to uh, for commissions. And uh, I, we just played some music for commercials because we had a little break. Um, and uh, is it a different? Is it different? Is it a different world for you to make music in an assignment as a commission or to make free work? Uh, my attitude is always same. It doesn't different. Even uh, commercial music, film, my music, anything, produce, arrangement, every time, same attitude. And are you very specific then? What commissions you you say yes to? Are, are you very specific to what commissions you say yes to, what you agree to work on? Yeah. <laughs> you say no, yeah. no a lot to yeah, a lot sometime. of... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but not so severe. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Most of the time he takes the offer or some commission, but he hundred percent he's sure when, when it's not gonna work, he said no only. <laughs> so he's not really picky. <laughs> Until more people ask you and more and more and then it becomes Yeah. Um where where do you get your inspiration from? Is it all from within or do you also have like outside things that inspire you in your work? Okay, uh, this is a little bit, I want to say something then I yes. give a gift.
それはあの、えー、なんだろうもうす,すごく音楽的に研究したかったっていうのとそれからすごくその音楽ミュージックじゃなくてその音のディテールがにすごく僕はも,もう惹かれて夢中になってたから音自体,音,自体、うん、音楽とそれからフィジカルサウンド、うん、な,んなんで、えー、ずっとそれ子供の頃からや,やっててでいろんなことが多分こうケミカルに何かこう混ざって,ざってこ,うこうなっちゃったんだろうねっていう自然に。He's been listening to all kind of music. From since、uh, small, when he was small, and he was more curious how sounds work s physically, mentally. And now he's just like trying to check many of music sounds and now kind of mixed up everything physically, mentally. And then now he said he is that's how, like a sponge, or、mm, yeah, yes. kind of, yes. <laughs> Uh, one of the things、uh, you put up, I think, is Bach.、Yep. Uh, you've made some very famous recordings. Shall、mm. I just play one shortly? Very shortly.、Uh, I do the Cero Suites Prelude number four, or number four prelude. Yeah, I think this may have been the first time Bach has been played at d e c k m a n t e l Festival, which I think is the first time for everything. Yes.、Um, is, is Bach your favorite? Or what does he mean to you? Because you made several recordings of his music. Okay,、uh, this, uh, this is a long process, then I can explain. Yes. Tone.、Uh, まずその「かかし歌方の日々」の時代からずっとそういうことをやっててある日僕はその例えばリズムとかベースそれからハーモニーみたいなのをちょっとさよならしたかったちょっとそれをうんうんいいそこまであそこまでこれ歌方とまあその80年代のあの経てである,ある日まあ、そういうちょっとその音楽の三要素みたいなのからちょっと離れたかった。うん uh, after he released、uh, Mariah and Kakashi, and at some point he wanted to be stay away from the rhythm, harmony, and he wanted to try something different.、うん、それからな,な,なんか一人だけでなんかできないかなと思,思いました。Uh, I, was, I thought、uh, I want to do alone, not with musicians. I, I 
thinking, uh, I thought、uh, なんか一人でなんかできたらいいなと思ってたところにあの He was thinking if he could, some, do, could do something by himself without any other musicians and then でそ,のそしてあの、えー、一人でなんかふいあのスタジオで吹いてたら、えー、その本棚から一枚ひらひらとこう、えー、譜面が降り,降りてきたのがそのバッハのチョロ組曲の一番のプレリュードだったの。<笑> Bach recordings of、uh, every piece,、uh, but you still make it very much your own and,、uh, and do a lot with it, which is quite outside of the borders of maybe of classical music, working with the acoustics and working with,、uh, with also make it into a different instrument、okay. to make it a saxophone. So, is that still the composer who is playing, or is it more the musician? Uh, yeah, maybe it's a, it's a weird question, but、uh, it feels like the,、uh, even if when you record an album as a saxophone player, there's still very much the composer at work. Somebody who makes the music himself and creates something new、mm. with the notes. No. <laughs> 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 うん、始まったんだけど、うん、だけど、えー、そのさっ,きさっきの途中だとでそれで、あのーえー、あのねパッとひらめいたのがバッハとテナーサクソフォンとスペースの三角関係あの三角関係なんだろうね<笑>、うん、トライアングルレレーションシップ。うん Uh, when he was playing saxophone in his studio, there was like one paper from Bach. Fall down from the shell. And <laughs> he came up with the idea Bach, tenor, tenor saxophone, tenor saxophone, and space. Ah,、uh, I have. t h a t time I got the idea of the triangle relationship of.、Uh, Back and tenor saxophone and space. And the space. And Each relationship is very interesting. For example, Baha and space. That is normal. Yeah. But、uh, Baha and tenor saxophone, that is re- really interesting for、yeah. me. And uh, uh, tenor saxophone and space. This is important because tenor saxophone is made by tube. Yeah. A、tube is really、uh, resonance yeah. With, with the、uh, air with in between. Yeah. Yeah. Like, a, like a,、uh, singing in the bathroom. Like a voice、yeah. going like, into、uh, it.、Yeah. Also, human body is tubes. Yeah. Stena saxophone is an extension. Yeah. Of, uh, and uh, I went outside to. Try many, many spaces, and I found a very, very big, long echo, very big storm mime or something. And I really, yeah. You felt it? Yeah. I, then I keep this、uh, idea and to make recording. That's cello suite, is then I recorded each suite different places. And I made six seats,、uh, took very long time, like five or six years. Wow. Wow.、Uh, our time is almost up, or it is up, but I have one last question. What can we expect from you、uh, in the near future? What are, you, are you working on something? Yes,、uh, I want to keep this、uh, project with、uh, Rei Kunimoto. And maybe、uh, more, I, can, I, I think we can develop more. And、uh, I have、uh, another group, 
sax called saxophonettes. Saxophonettes, yeah. That is uh, five saxophones, uh, mainly uh, three tenor saxophones and two baritone. And uh, so also uh, that group, uh, uh, for example, recording like a big spaces or uh, and uh, uh, simple and complicated ensemble. Okay. And uh, uh, also I uh, want recording a Baha project that is, uh, uh, I want to do next, uh, Art of Funa. Art of Funa? Yeah, yeah. Not yet. <laughs> uh, do you know when it's coming? Uh, Near f- I, yeah, we'll see. I, <laughs> we'll see. Already uh, I arranged, arranged for saxophonettes, and uh, sometimes we play uh, one or two or three, but uh, not whole. Great. We're very curious to hear it. <laughs> uh, thank you very much, Yashuaku Shimitsu, for your time you and much, for your you. performance. Hmm. Uh, we're going to continue here with uh, Speki Webu, I think. Uh, we'll play one track of your music just when we're here, Dementos. Um, and enjoy the rest of the day here at Deckmantel in Musikgebouw and around the eye. <laughs> 